Hello everyone, my name is Alex, welcome to another episode of Let's Check Out Some iPad. Today we've got a game called Wraithborn. Uh, this is brought to us from CM Games, and uh, it's an action RPG, uh, not all that dissimilar from Diablo, but with um, with a more arcade type aspect, so less of the loot collect and, and that sort of thing that uh, Diablo is known for, but uh, same style of game. Uh, you only have one character to choose from, uh, but uh, it's more focused on uh, scoring. Um, so if we have a look at the uh, uh, the game center uh, menu here, uh, it's got uh, achievements and you can set up challenges for your friends as well as uh, leaderboards. So um, there's a, a score, well, I'm sure that uh, score is legit, looks legit. <laughs> Congratulations, final arc. Um, yeah, so uh, let's dive in and I'll give you a bit of a rundown of the game. I'm reasonably close to the start here, and uh, you'll you'll get a good feel for it uh, initially. Uh, so it's it's uh, top down, uh, same as uh, same as Diablo, very actually very similar art style uh, to Diablo, Diablo three. Uh, graphics are amazing, and this is running on an iPad too, so I could just imagine what it would look like on uh, one of the new iPads, or especially the iPad four with uh, with the new power. It has. Um, okay, so you can see my uh, my avatar on the top left. Next to that is my health in the green, uh, and my uh, action points, I guess, in the blue. Uh, now you can refill those uh, by collecting green and blue uh, gems that drop when you uh, kill enemies, and uh, you can also collect uh, the purple gems from these things. So as you can see, I got a total of 43. Uh, let's see if we can increase that a little bit more. Nope, nothing in that one. Uh, so they are used, uh, I believe, to uh, to power up some of your spells. Let's have a look. Uh, okay, so... Yes, this is it indeed. Okay, so we've got uh, two runes available at the moment, uh, and we can add a third uh, if we want. Well, we, do, we don't have a third yet, but uh, we will eventually. Now, runes are your magical attacks, your special attacks. Uh, so things like Soilo. Range damage cone attack. Multiple waves of fire emanate from you. This rune replaces your power attack with a cone of damaging fireballs. Very good. You've got uh, Fihu, <laughs> which is uh, the one that you start off with. Instantly da instant damage radius. So it's like an AoE effect. Um, and the beautiful thing about the runes is that you actually have to draw or fill in the uh, the rune on the screen. And the more of that you fill in, uh, the more powerful it is, the the, the more effective it is. Uh, so we have two at the moment. We've got Fihu, which is the uh, AoE attack, and uh, Othala. Blast your enemies with force. This rune replaces your power attack with a ranged bolt that stuns a single enemy. Uh, so I'm going to actually upgrade Fihu because it's quite decent. Uh, so we upgrade. Now, possible upgrades. Increases the damage and distance of the radius effect and reduces the cooldown. Well, that's pretty decent. All right, let's do that. So the next one costs 100. You can sort of see where this is going. Um, now, there is no, as far as I'm aware, there is no in-app purchases yet, uh, but uh, the developer may, may add that if, uh, if they choose to. Uh, so you can see the on-screen touch controls here. Uh, you can It's actually nice because you can see what I'm doing. Uh, you've got uh, a block function. When enemies hit you while you're blocking, the blue gems at the top of the screen decrease. Uh, so, so you sort of use your power to block. Uh, you've got a standard attack, which can then be comboed with your large attack. And uh, yeah, let's let's move on. Uh, so the graphics are absolutely stunning. Uh, again, I'm amazed this is running on an iPad 2. I know that sounds ridiculous to say, considering the uh, iPad 2 is only like a year and a half old. So as you can see, very standard, and it doesn't have the depth of a game like Diablo or Torchlight. Uh, it's just more of more of an arcade style game, but I'm okay with that. We'll cross the bridge here. Again, the, the landscape is just amazing. Oh, he's blocking my attack. Uh, and at the end of every uh, segment, there's usually a boss battle, and it's uh, announced with uh, like a 
you versus uh, the boss on screen. I will get to show you that pretty soon, I'm, I'm sure. Across another bridge down here. Okay, so we've got a health power up. We won't collect those just yet. We don't need them at the moment. Oh, lots of dudes here. Okay, so now might be a good time to show off my area of effect rune spell. So within the time limit, you've got to trace the rune, and then, bam, it uh, does a lot of damage. What's this? This is a wraith, by the looks of it. Ooh, okay, she's tough and can teleport. I hate it when that happens. Oh my goodness, okay. Come on. It's funny, I never usually block in games like this, but uh, in Wraith when you do need to, it's 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 required. So as you can see, it took... Every time she hits me, it takes uh, one of my gems off. And there you saw uh, me unleash my special move. Uh, after blocking for a little bit of time, you uh, you power up like a... Like a super super slam, which is cool. It does look like there's a, a reasonable amount of uh, area to cover, and little uh, little hidden passages and things that uh, are probably rewarding if you uh, manage to find something nice in them. So again, just going back to the graphics, uh, it's absolutely amazing. The the level of detail is just brilliant. Okay, so now we have a uh, wardstone. These are, uh, they serve as checkpoints and energy refills. Uh, so if we stand in the wardstone, uh, you can see my energy is recharging. I will uh, channel it by holding the shield button. And uh, we've got a boss battle here. So this is where uh, the arcade sort of style comes out. Things like waves and waves of enemies. That was very nice, I used that to my advantage. Um, you have to survive as long as you can and you get a score for killing the enemies, uh, which is where the leaderboard situation can come in. So that's, uh, my objective is complete for taking him out. And we got another rune. Call down fiery rocks from the sky, I like that. So there we have it folks, that is Wraithborn. My name is Alex, this has been another episode of Let's Check Out Some iPad. I'll put the uh, App Store link in the description below. Feel free to check it out, it's from a company called CM Games, Crescent Moon Games. Uh, but that's me, that's Alex. I'll see you again soon, thanks very much, bye bye.